Hello and welcome to Let's Play Clock Tower. If you're seeing this, I've actually recorded the entire game because I'm really bad at keeping the deadlines, so I figured I'd go ahead and record the entire game before I uploaded anything. Hopefully this will be out by Halloween of 2012 because that's my goal here. But you know me and deadlines and I'm usually pretty bad with them, so hopefully this will go alright. All right. This is an adventure horror game for the Super Nintendo, if you've never heard of it before. It's a game that I've played a little bit of. It's a semi-blind LP, and even if I had played it before, there's some random elements to the game and some things that change, so you won't immediately know everything just by having played it before. Anyway, let's get started. Raised in the Granite Orphanage, Jennifer and her friends were wanted as adopted daughters. It happened in September. Laura, hurry up! We want to be there before sunset. Miss Mary? Yes? From now on, what kind of place will we be living in? That's the fifth time you've asked. Don't worry, it's a very nice place. We're almost there, see? It looks like the Hell House. You'll be safe there from axe murderers. You could see the blood coming out of the walls in a place like this, really. What a huge place. <clears throat> yeah. The main hall's gigantic. I gotta go get Mr. Barrows. Everyone wait here. She doesn't look anything like her portrait in the game. And with that, I'm in control. Here's our protagonist, Jennifer. And here's other people. We will uh, get to know a few things about them, hopefully. Hey, Anne. You wanted to know what kind of guy Mr. Barrows is, right? Yeah. And you have to actually uh, click on her again to get her to talk more. Hey, Anne. And then she just says the same thing over and over again, so... Yeah, she's useless. What is it? Is something wrong? This house makes me uneasy. Yeah, I gotta do like six different female voices. I know how you feel. I doubt I'll ever get used to this place. Hmm? <laughs> Lots paranoid. Mary, she's taking a long time. Should I go find her? Or Miss Mary? No, I'll go look for her. And in her infinite wisdom, Jennifer has doomed herself. And me. The main hall? Girls? Come on, this isn't funny. <sighs> Alright, and thus begins our adventure. Can I turn the lights back on? 
I actually don't think I ever tried. Oh, well, that worked. Well, I uh, guess we can just go this way. And yeah, um, you can actually do that in the vanilla game, but uh, the emulator lets you speed things up, so I'm going to be doing that quite a bit for the walking in this game. If you guys don't, well, I guess by the time I upload this, it'll be too late to get feedback, but uh, if you don't like it, I apologize. I'm just trying to save everybody and myself a little bit of time. That's always been kind of my philosophy with LP. Just, oh, shit. Well, <clears throat> I guess we're not going that way. That's always been kind of my philosophy with doing these kind of games, is to, uh, get down the fucking stairs. <clears throat> it's to save everyone's time. I don't like it when, uh, LPers of games waste a lot of time doing the same stuff, like me trying to figure out how to get downstairs. Really? Ah, there we go. Alright then, well, uh, since we broke things in the house already, I guess we can go through the door we were supposed to go through then. Can we go in here? I think I saw... yep, maybe. Gotta find the hot spot here. Guess we can go in this first room. And it's... pretty much nothing. So you moved into this house that had apparently high architectural damage to it. What are we doing? A pile of trash, wooden concrete, pocketed a rock. I'm amazed I was able to read that. There's a deep crack in the wall. It's crumbling. Okay, you can't go through it or anything. Jesus says that again. Away! Guess we can check out what's over here. So the, the locations in the rooms are randomized, I believe, so... I actually don't know where anything is. The lights are out. Where's the switch? Right behind you, near the door, where they usually are. And this room looks horrifying, by the way. I wonder if there's a severed limb in this box. There's a key in here. Pocketed the West Wing key. Well, we can always see what's on the TV. Looks like it's broken. It's not broken, it's just staticky. Okay, how about the painting? She has nothing to say about the painting. Nothing to say about the table. What about the window? It looks completely dark outside. What time is it now? Didn't we just get here, like, in the middle of the day? I don't know. Got a paint- uh, looks like a mirror and a painting or a picture or something over here. What is this thing? Looks like children or something. A small bottle of perfume. Hmm. It smells like Miss Mary's. Picked up perfume. I have no idea how to get to my inventory in this game. Okay, apparently uh, the B button have a rock and perfume. Get up. Get up. Looks like the left bed isn't used. Looks like the left bed isn't used. Okay. Says that on both beds, apparently. Well, that's unpleasant. Don't go over by the bird.
Let's get out of here. He sounds like a very serious parrot. Well, we have perfume and a key. I don't like the sound of that. I don't know if it's supposed to be like that or if this is the emulator glitching or something, but uh, I can manage well enough, I think. First, let's examine the toilet. I don't have to go right now. <laughs> uh, good things can't be back here. And it's our antagonist. Open the door! Could you be a little more urgent, please? Just a little. Okay, so he's gonna be chasing us for a while now until we find some way to shake him. We're going upstairs. You know, there's some more rooms up here we haven't been to. Alright, so top, 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 top. Use the West Wing key. I'm unwittingly making progress, guys. I'm running out of stamina because I'm running everywhere. Ah. Arr. And the floor killed me. Arr. I have our first death of the game, apparently, is the floor. I was a bit too low on energy. Um, that's one of the things you can tell by her portrait. The color in the background is actually your health or energy. And the darker color that gets, the less energy you have. Well, I can't seem to... Okay, can we just rest here for a while then? <laughs> a scream came from outside. <laughs> oh god. I gotta figure out how to stop running. <laughs> That's not funny. Locked. How about this door then? Is that also locked? Nope. Well, I don't see uh, Edward Scissorhands anywhere, so. Stop it! I don't guess we can do anything with this. Looks like you should be able to pick this up, but I don't guess you can. What the hell is this? Okay. That all looks important, but I can't do anything with it right now. It could be because the game's still in chase mode or something, but... Jesus. Put more effort into it! Ugh. I got scissored. It's gonna be a long game, guys. It's gonna be a long game. Apparently I can't just wait there until I get some energy back either, so...
All right, guys, I think I got it. So what we're going to want to do is tap the A button. Well, it's the A button on a 360 controller. I don't know what it is on a Super Nintendo. Huh? He's too short to climb over the bookcase. Take that! Yeah, I really need to figure out how to get rid of these glitches in the graphics down here. They're a little distracting. Kind of take you out of the mood. It's some broken tableware. And underwear. Nothing to do with that. Nothing to do with that, apparently. Nothing else here. So quick to dismiss the room you are. Anything over here? Various things are scattered around. Okay, now that the chase is over, can I interact with any of this stuff? I can, actually. Looks like a bird's nest. I will prod it with this giant stick. Like an asshole. <laughs> Get out of here! Huh? Well, well, I'll throw a rock at it. You're gonna let me do it, aren't you? No. Okay. I don't guess perfume would do anything, now would it? Alright. Lesson learned. Okay, now well, I suppose we keep exploring then. There's nothing in there except the death trap. So I don't guess we need to go there for now. Let's just head back downstairs. What's this way? Go through here. This should supposedly be underneath where we fell from last time, or well, we broke the floor. A scream came from outside. Too bad I don't know how to get outside. Question mark? The door seems to be stuck. I'll open it with my perfume. Hmm? It seems the door is locked. I'm gonna run into something horrible doing that one of these days. Okay. Well, there's probably someone dead outside now. That's how these sort of things seem to work. It's locked. How about this other door, then? Not locked. Well, this place looks like where people go to die. An iron frying pan. Let's turn the lights on. Make me feel a little better about myself. I could go for a snack right about now. A ham was put in here. I picked up some ham. You gotta love adventure games. A calendar. There's something shiny in here. Oh, oh. Away! I am the hell out of here. Urgency, woman, urgency! character has none of it. 
So I don't know if you rest in the same place long enough, you'll get your energy back. So I'm going to try to do some of that right now. Do a little bit of resting. And I guess try to figure out where to go next. Uh, we need to go outside, I suppose. The game kind of hinted that. Have a rock, perfume, and some ham. Yeah. Meat. A shovel. You can get up here in the hayloft or something. And there's no reason to be up here. One second, guys. I'm going to do a little uh, saving real quick. I probably should have done that earlier in the game, but I didn't. So what do we got over here? We have, uh, looks like a crate. This is a key. A car key. Now, I already know enough about this game to know this isn't good. But I suppose for completion's sake, we can go ahead and do it. I'm not going to show you all the endings, though, because I don't know how to get all the endings. The keys aren't there. You just picked up the car keys. I can get out of here with this car. But the others. No. No, I want to get out of here. Selfishness always works out. What should I do? Really? It's that classic three times warning an adventure game will give you. Oh wow, was that not the bad ending? I don't know. Well, that was a short game. This is obviously not the ideal ending to the game. And yeah, I must be getting to the credits real quick. Not fast enough for my taste, sadly, but... You know, I suppose I could just speed stuff up a little bit more in Vegas. Oh well. Ah, here we go. <laughs> Always check the back seat. But we don't want that. I suppose I can go ahead and pick up the car keys. Even though we're not going to take the car out of here. I guess I can take the spade. Nope. Anything in the hay? And then I ran headlong into danger. So I suppose I can walk all the way back to the other end of the house. Three doors? Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, we're in here. And there was this room that was the bedroom, right? So was this door. I guess we can look around in the distorted bathroom. Since we have a little bit more time now. Looks like the shower is working. Looks like the shower is working. Looks like the shower is working. And then we can take over here. I'll wash my hands. Maggots! 
That made me jump, by the way. <laughs> I was not expecting anything in the sink. Oh, I guess I learned our lesson about cleanliness, now didn't we? You should see what's in the toilet. Was this here before? Yeah, because it's led to this little uh, hole. Looks like you could crawl through there. It's hard to imagine you couldn't just crawl through there, but I guess not. Locked. So do we go upstairs then? But there's a big hole in the floor upstairs. But this way. There isn't shit this way. What happened to the big hole in the floor? There it is. And it made me jump a second time. The other side's too far away. I've already managed to get stuck in this game and don't really know where to go next. Hmm. What doors haven't I been in yet? Guess we can examine these rooms a bit more thoroughly. Painting looks significant or something, but I don't know what there's about it. Empty. TV's probably still broken. A comfortable sofa. A not so comfortable sofa. Pull on the curtains. It'll end well. It wasn't dark in here before, was it? Well, the parent went back in his cage. Good little lad. Um, ham. Would you like some ham? No, oh, I was trying to give you ham. Ham. Everybody loves ham. Ham. go insane if I don't get out of here. What the fuck are you doing? Huh. Nice. I caught the bird. Not intentionally, but I caught the bird. Never works. Looks like the left bed isn't used. <laughs> That's all she has to say about that, apparently. Damn, I'm sexy. Okay then, anything in the uh, cage? That was pointless. Well, we caged the bird. Or rather, we uncaged the bird and put him on a blanket. It seems kind of like animal cruelty. You know, he just said something you didn't like. You didn't like? Ugh. I can't talk today. When can I ever talk, though? Where is there a phone in this house? I keep hearing one. Okay, we can go back in the murder room. Seems this door is locked, even though it wasn't earlier. Door seems to be locked as well. How about in the meat locker room? Uh, it's in the meat locker room. It's a room with a flickering flaw. There wasn't anything to do in here, though. What's this? Some rope. Picked up some rope. I 
A can of insecticide. I don't know what we can use that for. You can get two cans of it? Nope. Okay, so we have insecticide now. Um, don't know what we do with the rope. But we can take the insecticide and go back to the meat locker room and maybe there's something inside there. Who knows? That's kind of the only lead I have right now. Back to the meat room! I'm trying to remember which way it was. It was in this hallway, I believe, and in one of these doors. All right, there we go. Victory! A key is left behind. Pocketed the gold key. Okay. Well, it's a start, I suppose. Anything over here? Gas tanks for a stove. Some eating utensils. Can't take the frying pan, I don't think. An iron frying pan that I can't take. I wouldn't want to waste electricity, after all. Okay, there's quite a few locked doors around here. No, no, no. God damn it. This way. Locked. Well, it's not that one. Clomp, 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 clomp. Okay, we can try this one upstairs real quick. Use the gold key. This room warrants a save state. Actually, you know what? No, 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 god damn it. The phone line's been cut. Even though the phone was still working. It must be a haunted phone. Seems to have been recently used. Some of the drink is still in there. Hmm. A silver key is under the glass. Pocketed the silver key. How about this suit of armor? We could just take the sword and defend ourselves. Nope. Looks like there's some women's clothing in here. What does that say? Looks like there's some women's clothing in here. This one's different. Picked up a black robe. That I can't put on. Oh well. So it's just gonna ring even though the phone line's been cut. Various beverages. Okay, well we have more items. We have another key to try. So, I guess this room was uh, kind of interesting, kind of useful. No real scares or anything, but kind of useful. Will the key work on this door now? No. I could swear that was the West Wing key. I might be wrong. I tend to be wrong quite a bit, but uh, I could have sworn that was the West Wing key. Game's playing with my mind. Use the silver key. I can already tell I don't like this place very much. God damn it. It is very hard to be precise with a controller. This is a game I really wish I had the mouse for, to be honest. Oh, 
Alright, well, what was over here? Nothing, apparently. So we can take these books. There's a note here. Time will cause adherence. The clock tower's clock stopped. Various chemicals are on the desk. There's a note. Time will cause adherence. Okay, we saw that already. Can't do anything with the chair. A mural covers the wall. Part of it's hidden behind that shelf. We move the shelf. Can't do anything with the shelf, actually. Nothing else to do on the desk. This room feels kind of pointless. I mean, I wouldn't imagine that would make us come all this way just for nothing, but... It's really the only lead I have right now is this room. Well, and I guess going outside is another lead, but I don't know how to get out there. Hmm... Be more to this room, though. There's nothing I can do with this shelf. Wait, wait, wait. There's a mural that covers the wall. Part of it's hidden behind the shelf, but you can't do anything with the shelf. Hmm. Well, I don't know then. Well, so much for progress. I think we could use maybe the, the rope to go across some chasms or something. Jennifer doesn't really seem like the athletic type. in here. Nothing I could interact with anyway. Hmm. There's not really even any puzzles to solve right now that I can think of. I don't can't there's nowhere I can't get that I know of. Maybe a few locked doors here and there. I don't know if that's a glitch or not, but it's kind of creepy. Yeah, we're going here. We were already in here. There's nothing to do. Well, I suppose we can go back into the main room. I haven't really tried clicking around in here all that much, I guess. Try not to skip ahead too much. I don't want to skip over anything if it happens. Locked, and I can't open it. Right, let's just go upstairs then. Clomp. Can we use the rope? That's it. <laughs> Alright, I've been doing this for about 45 minutes or so, so I think I'm going to go ahead and cut the video off here. Uh, we'll see you in the next episode, where hopefully we will figure out what else we can do with ourselves. And hopefully figure out a way to get outside. That'd be nice, too. Anyways, as always, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Later, guys.